My lips are usually flaky, flaky dry, but since I've been using it, they have been really nice, not dry or flaky at all. So for $2.80, I would definitely pick this up. Next, I have this little guy, and this is a mascara helper. So you put a few drops of this into your mascara if it has gone clumpy or dry, and it kind of revives it. And your mascara is like brand new again. I absolutely love, love, love this stuff. I mean, I don't really need this because I have a gazillion mascaras to try, but if you really are loving a favorite like me, I'm loving the Essence Princess Lash and it's starting to dry up and run out. I put a few drops of this in and now it's perfect. Next again. is a similar thing, but it's for your nail polish. And this is a nail polish thinner. It comes in a little packet with the nail polish thinner and a little dropper. And it's the same thing if your nail polish is getting really gluggy or dry, you put a few drops of this in, shake it around, and it basically makes it like brand new again. So I really, really like this stuff. Okay, the next thing from Daiso is this Deep H Moisture Gel with Hyaluronic Acid. And this is just a face moisturizer. I use this during the day under my makeup and at night because my skin is extremely dry and dehydrated and this works wonders. I cannot believe this is $2.80. This hydrates my skin so, so well and makes it feel so moisturized. It plumps the skin, skin up. It makes my skin look a lot smoother. And I just really, really love this little guy. This container. I got this container and the nails that are inside from Daiso. The container was $2.80 and the nails were $2.80. So you get 80 nails in a packet for $2.80 and they're all different sizes. This is what they look like. It's just like a natural color and they go over your whole nail. And I've just been using these instead of acrylics because my nails have been so damaged in the past from acrylics, but I still wanna have long nails and these are way less damaging. And then I have a review on this Nailene Ultra Quick Nail Glue. This cost me about $4 for a two pack. And again, it's by Nailene. And this is the best glue so far that I have used from a supermarket or BW or whatever. I love this. It dries really, really quickly and it holds the nail on so, so well. So I highly, highly recommend these. Recently, Priceline had a 40% off skincare sale and I wanted to pick up something for my skin that would really help it a lot. So I picked up this Dr. Lewin's Reversoderm glycolic clarifying cleanser and it is a hundred mils of product and it just says it cleanses and helps to diminish the signs of photo aging and sun damage and it contains 12 percent glycolic acid and usually this is quite expensive but when i picked it up it was 23 dollars which I think is really reasonable for a cleanser this size. When you pump it out, it is just like a cream. I haven't noticed a difference in using this yet, unfortunately, excuse me, but I've only been using this for about a week or so, but I'll definitely let you guys know how this goes. Okay, on to my makeup products. The first thing, I went to Cosmetics Plus probably about three weeks ago and picked this up. It's the BYS Velvet Lips Liquid Lipstick. This was only $6.95. It's in the color Bare Beauty. This is absolutely amazing. I wanna go and pick up the whole collection of these. I've actually just entered a competition on Instagram to try and win the whole set of these. They are amazing. This is what the applicator looks like. It's a very long doe foot ap applicator but it is very easy to apply lipstick with this stuff. And I'll just do a swatch for you guys. 
and this is what it looks like. This is honestly one of the best affordable matte lip creams I have tried and I feel that BYS doesn't get a lot of hype or not many people talk about it and I love BYS. I always have and I feel it is very, very underrated. Next up, I have these brand new little guys from Priceline. I picked them up for $14.95 each. So first of all, we're going to talk about the banana powder. So this is just what it looks like. It is quite yellow. To touch, it is extremely, extremely finely milled, creamy and soft. It just feels so good and it is pigmented. That is one swipe of the banana powder and it is so pigmented. This highlights under the eyes absolutely beautifully. I just really, really enjoy this and it is definitely worth the $14.95. Next we'll talk about the highlighter. This is called the High Life Highlighting Powder by Astralis. So yeah, I absolutely love this one as well. It's such a beautiful highlighter. It is creamy, pigmented, smooth. It's just really, really pretty. So that's what it looks like just there. You can't really, I don't know if you guys can see what a beautiful sheen that it gives, but it is absolutely stunning. Okay, product from Lush. Now I absolutely love Lush and I'm sure many of us do. But I recently picked up a whole heap of soaps from Lush and my favorite is this one. This is Maypole. Oh guys, this smells so beautiful. It smells minty and I just can't explain it. This smells minty yet sweet. It is just absolutely beautiful. I am definitely, definitely going to pick this up time and time again. It is just absolutely beautiful and because it does smell minty, I feel when I'm washing my body with it and my face that it just gives such a cool, refreshing feeling. So this is what I'm talking about next. It is the Fitbit Flex watch and this tracks your sleep, steps, activity, calories and stuff like that. I got picked this up really cheap off a Facebook selling page and I just love it. It really counts my steps and just helps me. Plus I have sleep apnea and I snore extremely bad and this just tracks my sleep and tells me how long I was restless for and how long I slept peacefully for and stuff like that. So I absolutely do recommend this. but. I forget to check my app out a lot on my phone so I really want to get the Fitbit HR charge because it has a screen and once you press the button on the side it will tell you your steps, your calories and stuff like that so I really want to get one with the screen because I feel like it would motivate me more because with one touch I can just look at my wrist and check it. So yeah, I just find this really does help motivate me. I have 20 kilos to lose, so anything that helps is good. The last thing I have to review for you guys is this Urban Decay Gwen Stefani palette. Now, as you probably all know if you have watched my videos before, this was a splurge purchase in Australia. This palette retails for $95, which is ridiculous but it's limited edition and I could die tomorrow. So I just thought, fuck it, I'm gonna buy it. Okay, so in this is the packaging and it is really pretty. And on the back, it just has all the shadows. And inside the box, it's just red with white polka dots. On the inside, you get these Gwen Stefani lipstick samples. You get four samples of lipstick. I'm yet to try these out. And then this is the palette itself. It is so gorgeous. It has a big metal plate here, gold trimming, the white and black dots. And then this is the back. It has a huge mirror and in the corner over here, it says magics in the makeup, which I thought was a really cute touch. And these are the shadows themselves. As you can see, I have used them quite a bit. Now, I didn't think this would be as wearable as what it is, but it really, really is. Like, there's so many neutral shades in here. There's matte, there's shimmers, there's satins. It's just beautiful. 
the only really pops of color is the yellow blue and pink down here the black I will use as a liner I will never put that on my eyes but that's because I have naturally very dark circles so whenever I wear a black shadow it just looks like I have been punched in the eye even more but I absolutely love this these are creamy buttery blend out like a dream like this was so worth the $95 and you know I have the naked three palette by Urban Decay and this one and then another small one like the book of shadows and they are just gorgeous and now I'm like do you know what the vice palette's $98 but I'm going to get that next because these shadows are absolutely amazing the last two things I'm going to show you guys is things that I have had for the last year or so and I absolutely love them. They are favourites of mine and I could not live without these. So this is the Too Faced Chocolate Bar Palette. Now this is absolutely amazing. The packaging is just so cute. Like honestly Too Faced with their packaging kill it every time i absolutely love Too faced products they are so amazing i am so excited to pick up the semi sweet palette and the bonbon palette i am dying to get those so you open this up and first of all oh it just smells like heaven because it smells like chocolate the mirror just looks like this it has this little sheet in here which has all of the kind of shade names on there. I keep this in there because they're not written underneath the shadows. And this is what this palette looks like. As you can see, it is well loved. Yeah, but this is just stunning. Like the colors, there is just mattes, there's shimmers, there's like foil looking shades. Like this is just so, so stunning. And the very last thing that I have to talk about is a perfume and this has been my favorite perfume for years and years and years I think first time that I purchased this was probably oh about five years ago six years ago and I just keep repurchasing it because it is absolutely amazing and it is the fancy perfume by Jessica Simpson I mean for starters look at the bottle it is just stunning packaging it looks quite classy and like it would be very expensive it is so so pretty I just absolutely love it the smell of this now I am sorry because I have no idea about explaining what scents smell like so don't listen to me but I'm just gonna tell you guys To me, this just smells girly, princessy, florally, just, oh, I can't explain it. I'm hopeless at explaining scents, but if you ever get the chance, go and smell this. It is always on sale for about $29. Just go and smell this, guys. It is absolutely amazing. So that is pretty much it. Thank you so much for watching my video. I want to thank everybody who has already subscribed to my channel. If you haven't subscribed to my channel already, please do. And if you have any video requests at all, please leave them down below and I would love to do them for you guys. Have a great day and I'll see you next time. Bye.